Hello, good evening, and welcome back to the second session of Fatal Frame 2 Crimson Butterfly. We are diving right into this. We're not holding back. It's been about a week since I played. I'm hoping everything's going to go fine. I'm sure it will. Oh, it's another spooky night. It's late. It's like almost 10.30, almost 11 tonight. It's a late night. And I am here for some spooks. I gotta, I gotta really quickly remind myself there are some old ornaments, objects on the shelf. None of them look especially useful. Yeah, that's right. A picks things up. Y opens menu. B pulls up camera, but I think so does. Nope, just B pulls up camera. Interesting. All right, all right. We get it. We go into this. Last we left off, our sister had decided to go running off to who knows flaming where. Who knows where. She's chasing some fucking butterflies. That's all I know. So let's go figure out where she went. There's something shiny on the floor. My use charm. Use radio on the menu to listen to the words held within the stone. Oh shit, okay. Uh, She said? That's odd. Go outside. Yes, please. Okay. I have a flashlight now, and I remember that there was that bridge waif back where said I couldn't cross it unless I had a flashlight. And while it is a graveyard, and I don't know if I particularly want to go to a graveyard, I'm going to go to the graveyard. Yeah, I'm going to do it. We'll make our way. Bye, Mayu. <laughs> Just leave. Told you not to follow the fucking butterflies. This is on you. I can't abandon my sister. Dick move on my part. Wonder if I can cross this now. Oh yeah, having a flashlight made this ten times safer. Hundred percent. Oh. Wow, I hate it here. It's everything I thought it would be, and more. What is this? Appears to lead into some sort of cave. The roots of a giant tree. Huh. Seems oddly specific. Crystal. Okay. Let's see what this is. There is no time. Just one of them must suffice. Hurry. For the village. We must perform the ritual ourselves. And kill her. Kill her. Kill her. 
Quickly, we must perform the ritual ourselves. One will suffice. Spirit orb. Nice. Door of the shrine is shut tight. Oh. Let's go ahead and get out of here. I don't think there's much left here for me. I've got a couple items though. I think we might have to come back later. That hole in the tree is odd. And that door to the shrine being closed is also strange. Back to the village here. Trying to figure out where Mayu went. go left? Anything here? Oh, okay, it's just too... There's something there? A frozen man. Can I go this way? No. Okay. Did you hear that? There's no water left in it, and a faint wind blows up from its dark depths. The surveyor must have been here. Near the well, there is a piece of a note. Village Report 2. Okay. I looked down into the old well, but it was pitch black and I couldn't see a thing. If you listen closely, you can only hear wind blowing, and it seems that the water has all dried up. I can't tell which was here first, the house or the well. Neither has been used in a long time. According to the records, this house used to belong to a powerful Tsuchikara family. In this village, the Osaka, Kiryu, and Tachibana families were also influential. Each house had its own crest and held power in the village. As a group, they were also in charge of a special ritual. Each was a branch of the Kurosawa family who administered to the cere who, who administered to the ceremony. They performed the role of priests. The Kurosawa name is scattered throughout the literature, but no concrete information is written. I have no doubt that they held absolute power, though. Where in the world did the villagers go? And how did you get out of this village? The answers to these questions lie within the Kurosawa house. I'm not sure how I know, but I have a strong feeling about this. Did I... I'm gonna check. Did I actually have any other other notes? Oh, I did. Okay, so that was the second one. Okay. Can I go in... What is this? Can I go in here? No. Let's run down. 
spell checker. The door seems to be locked. So it's good to know that there's a save there. Oh, hold up. Did I just see the... Oh, okay. My bad. I thought I saw my little spirit gauge thing in the bottom glow. She went to the right. Door's locked. Can I go this way? I can. Question is, do we? We do. We absolutely do. Let's see what we got. Was that like a like a premonition? Like, what was that? That was weird. Huh? What are you? There are rose statue guardians deities here. The carver and children. They've been worn away by wind and rain. You can't even see their expressions anymore. I want the little little windmill thingy. the giant tree there's a hole it appears to lead into some sort of cave I wonder if this will be a way to get over to the graveyard looks like the same tree all right let's go up here let's see what's going on Shadow.
A door on the door of what appears to be a shrine, a large butterfly, Marcus displayed. The surveyor must have been here. On the stairs in front of the entrance is a, a piece of note lies. Village Report 3. I found a small shrine at the top of a long set of stairs shrouded in mist. It seems very old, but it is well made and has not fallen in disrepair. The entrance has a large butterfly crest painted on it. It's the same as the one on the building beyond the large bridge. Large bridge. Butterflies seem to have a special meaning, just like twins. They are frequently mentioned in the ritual literature. Butterfly means something else to the villagers, too. I noticed that the word always appears in writ writings about the ritual. I may not know its exact meaning, but the fact that the butterfly crest is on a shrine indicates that it is very special indeed. I should investigate further. Hmm. That's butterfly shaped, yeah. Did that count? Nope. Fuck! Damn recharge time. Bummer. Okay, good to know, though, that that's a dead end over there. We're starting to learn our way around this place. Go ahead and see. Way to go. Oh! My you! The hell are you doing? Get back here. Whoa, this is kind of an intricate place. Close that damn door on me. What the fuck? Here they are. The fucking butterflies. What the? Looks like a villager. Giant stick, I'm gonna paint in my butt. <laughs> 